What's up, you guys? It's Extra Eric from 103.3 Amp Radio, and I am freaking out because I am here with Little Mix. Yay! How are you guys? We're good. Bloody fantastic. Are you? you must know, yes. Are you enjoying Boston so far? Yeah. Where'd you go shopping? <laughs> well, why didn't you come? You could have got taxi, eh? Lazy I mean, bones. No, you were really doing looked up on face It's really kicking off. Rang my mum yesterday and I was like, I might just stay in. So actually I was thinking I might go shopping and she went, please no. What? Just don't. I went, what's wrong? She was like, don't go out by yourself in Here? America, right? I think because she knows I'm such a child that I would probably get lost oh. and not know where I was. Think Boston's blah, blah, blah. dangerous. No. I you hate going out by yourself. Yeah, yeah. You, don't, you, don't, you do hate it. Very street. To me shots. I just spend oh. I just spend that I didn't need to spend. Yeah. All the time. Goes everywhere well, first you. to start off, because can we talk about the shout out to my ex performance from the Brit Awards real quick? Oh, yeah. Can I just say I'm actually a fangirl of our own performance. I keep watching it. Uh, <laughs> I can't stop watching it. When you got off the stage, did you just <laughs> I'm such a nerd, but I keep watching. I'm like <laughs> When you got off the stage though, did you just look at each other and go like we just did that? Yeah. Because, right, no one understands. We had two days to rehearse. Are you serious? I swear to no. God, two days. And it was whilst being on this tour, traveling back to London, it was just horrendous. And no one understands the stress that we went through before that. Like, everyone just thinks that we went on stage and did this amazing performance, but no one knew what went down. What was wrong? I can't believe that. Just laughing. laughing at Miss If you just, like, stand there and just look at Jay, just observe her, she's so bizarre. Like, honestly, like the most bizarre person you'll ever see in your life. <laughs> anyway, carry on. What were you going to say? I was going to say, our first rehearsal, we got there oh. and the music wasn't right. Oh. Everything And the wasn't music right. was just terrible. completely changed wrong. up the arrangement. Yeah, it was all wrong. We and then we were like, right, <laughs> do we just choreograph something to nothing and then hope it fits? Yeah. Is that what? what you did? Yeah. Basically, yeah. the rehearsals that we were meant to have didn't happen because of the fact that we didn't have the music. So we were literally just making up our own song. And we were mm -hmm. like, right. So we rung our choreographer and was like, right, you need to tell the people of our label that we want this, 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 that, and this. And then it ended up happening, but it was just the most yeah. stressful yeah. experience. Flawless from start to finish. Because the second it went off with the oh, choreo to the beats, no. have you, you, have you seen? seen what we were like b backstage. We yeah. were crapping ourselves. We oh, like, you never would have oh, known. We had two days. So it wasn't in our heads properly. Like yeah. it wasn't muscle memory yet. So we yeah. were just absolutely crapping ourselves. It reminded me of Beyonce's VMA performance of oh. Ring the Alarm from the start, the breakdown. Oh. The second I saw this, I was like, wow. that's it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so in. much. That is a lovely Aww. compliment. And I must say, everyone did say that you looked like Beyonce. So. Yeah, you did. I said the same thing and Kim Kardashian with the long hair. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, everyone. It. I love Rash. <laughs> <laughs> they were right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's jump into touch because you, well, we just got on Spotify today for the US for the Kid Ink version. How'd that collab come about? Ooh. With Kid Ink? Yeah. Well, we wanted to have just something a bit different than we would touch anyway. Mm. Like you can play in the club, it's just a bit more cool, you can get down to it. And we thought it wouldn't be complete without a really cool rapper. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, Kid Ink was interested and we were like, yo, Kid Ink, like you wanna, Kid you wanna <laughs> collab and boom. Here we are. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you die when Ed Sheeran covered it for the Live Lounge? Oh. Since yes! you're such an Ed Sheeran fan? Love we all are, it. we love him. We were just like, oh my gosh, he's amazing, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. And Unreal. he did it justice. So thank you, Ed, we love you. Yeah. We do love you, Ginge. And mm. another question, my friend, from work and I have for Glory Days because we're such Glory Days fans. Why did Touch get the acoustic treatment on the deluxe edition? Oh. Why was that the track Ooh. that got picked? Good question. Because I think it's a club song. So we really wanted to just break it down and make you yeah. really understand different. the meaning of the actual song, you know, and how it makes yeah. you feel inside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we love the arrangement that we put together. For yeah. Mm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like the acoustic? I do love the acoustic, but it's just funny because like once Freak is ending and you're just like so pumping oh, and then it yeah. just, and then it just yeah, mellow. like jamming in the car, yeah, oh, front to back. The album. Not, I have the vinyl. Beep beep. No way. You know me. I was gonna ask you if you're feeling naughty today because I was hoping I need to see it at some point I soon. Always feel naughty. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you want to see beep beep? I want to see it live oh, so bad. I really, I picture it on tour being like behind a screen or like oh, silhouette. Yes, and love like that. a car silhouette. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we'd love to perform that one. But we'll be yeah. seeing it tonight. Oh, not tonight. No. It's a bit rude for the Anna Rihanna fans. <laughs> yeah. I think it's our like 
Adidas of Glory Days, yeah. Yeah. isn't it? I'd say. Also a bomb song. Thank you. Yeah, mm. that one. I do. Aww. What's your favorite album? Go. Part with Glory Days and then yeah. Salute. Ooh, yes, yes, we love Salute. Because Competition's my other favorite from oh. Salute. Oh. I love that Amazing. One. I know it all. That's Thank so nice. you. The one American so far that's been like on top of the game. Um, yeah, because I was like, what's your favorite? And they're like, um, the one. I love Move. Out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> So, like, how do you pick a single from this album when every single song could be a single? Oh, like, is there any... Nice. You know it, though. Like, uh, going through F.U. Oops, Power. Yeah, single, yeah. Single, it was, yeah, was really tough. Because yeah. we just love everything. Mm. Yeah. 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 And we have to listen to the fans as well for what they want. Like, I feel like everyone's happy that this is the next single. Yeah. Well, thank you guys so much. Thank you. <laughs>